Hi there, Massimo from the Blue Root team. And today I want to show you, kind of give you a bit of a walkthrough of Zoho Begin. How to use it on an everyday basis, uh, where to click, how to find things, how to add notes, things of that nature. So what, what you see here is the deal page. And this is predominantly where most people will live inside of Begin. Now in other videos, I showed you how to set up stages and set up pipelines. One of the things I want to show you here is you can very easily move things between stages, which is a great feature. And a lot of people like that about begin. Let's go into a deal. Sorry, this happens sometimes. So now I'm in a deal. I want to walk through a few of the things you're seeing here. So number one, this shows you who you're actually dealing with, like the related person on this deal and what their email is. So it gives you quick access to that. It tells you which company this is related to. So Blue Root is the person you're selling to. Tags are a handy feature. You can use them kind of on the fly or as a better way to manage your data. This, this here would be any custom fields that you create in our earlier video. So basically here, this is like the editable card, I would call it. And then in the middle of the page, Zoho Begin puts all of the related lists. So anything related to this client. So you can see here's some notes. You can write some notes, hey, or talk to Massimo, and he seems good to go. You could also tag a colleague, right? And they will actually get a notification if you want. You can attach a file as well, and you can also put a note. So this is a really handy process to actually go through when you're calling these people or organizing your data. There's an activities tab. And what Zoho determines as an activity is any interaction with the client. So whether that be a task, an event, or a call. So a task is a to-do item. It has a date that it has to be done by. So call Massimo back. You can put a date on it. You can tell it to repeat every day, every week, etc. This is something I use quite a bit in my system. So you can see it's due on the 31st. I might say, well, I want a notification a day before at 8 a.m. I do this a lot when I have to write up a proposal. I'll say it's due by this day, but I want a notification one day before. So I remember to get ready. And then you can hit save. So now I've got a task due in a little while to call this person. Emails, this will actually show you all the emails you've sent or received to the client once you integrate your emails in my other video. Stage history, there isn't a lot to like really understand here, but at a high level, this is tracking how long it takes for you to move from stage to stage. So Zoho Auto does this. You don't have to worry about it, but it'll come in handy when you start running some reports to see how efficient or not your business is. So very quickly, I can look at this and be like, whoa, it took 252 days to get out of qualification. We got a problem with our qualifying process, right? So that's what this is made for. Files, you can actually uh, upload files from your computer and have it here. And products for people that sell products, you can actually have products here. I'm not going to explain that too much today. So a couple other things with this tab are, one, you can reorganize these lists. So you can actually hit this and tell begin to put like stage history above everything else. And now you can see it's ahead. You cannot touch timelines or notes, um, but this is kind of your hub for a deal. And then you saw on the deal Kanban page, they call it, um, we had vertical columns. Well, those columns are right here. So you could either move the stage by doing this, or you can actually click the next stage. And what that's doing back out here is it's actually moving it, right? So this is happening within the deal. So that's kind of a high level of the deal, what it looks like, what all the pieces are within it. Um, in separate videos, I'll show you the best practice on how to follow up with people. Cheers.